working as a DeFi developer, there are a couple of tools which I use on my regular basis to debug my transactions. Just imagine that I'm trying to make a call to a contract. So I want to know that how the transaction is taking place and what amount of gas is getting consumed for making that transaction. So as a developer, as a DeFi developer, you have to do the analysis of the transactions so you can easily be able to predict the output and that will help you a lot to increase your understanding in the smart contract development. So this is the tool which I use very frequently. It is one of the powerful tools which you can find and it will tell you the visual representation of the contract interaction. So it's called Pigen Pi. I hope I'm pronouncing this right. Here you can able to find the entire token prices, entire transaction history, and you can able to monitor every single data, which you have to know as a DeFi developer. So you can see this is how the interface would look like. You can simply scroll and you can have a bunch of data, which is absolutely goldmine for you. You can able to see the trade volume, arbitrage, sandwich, liquidity counts. These are the amazing data. You can easily able to get this data and you can build a automated system where you can analyze the trend of the token and the fluctuation of the price. And that will help you uh, again amazingly if you are working in a decentralized spines and building a product which can allow user to do the trade so that in that context this data will help you a lot so you can come back to the home page and you can able to find all of this data you can able to see the pricing and if you come back here here we have the sandwich you can able to have the idea the transaction cost profit and cost okay tons of things we have we have the liquid liquidation you can see the liquidation count and the amount of transaction is taking place in the liquidation and here we have the data of the liquidity provider and borrowers so you can have this idea this is the flash loan tons of things we have but the thing i want to talk about in this video about the transaction debugging is this one so for debugging any transactions you need the transaction has so i will come back to this particular one ether scan and here i have already picked a particular transaction it's actually a transaction of Uniswap v3 and it's it's a swap transaction so you can see able to find all of these data that how the contracts got interacted and how everything is taking place so all you have to do to debug this particular transaction to see that which contract this transaction is interacting with you need to take this hash this transaction hash and you have to come back to this particular website simply click here and you have to paste the paste the address of that particular transaction sorry hash of the transaction now click on this search and this will give you amazing idea so you can easily able to understand and have a complete understanding that how the transaction is taking place so you can see that for making this particular transaction there is a lot of contracts involved so you can see this is the liquidity uniswap v3 pool like this is the one you have interacted then it's go to uniswap v3 router so this is another contract we have which we are interacting and that's taking us to the v uniswap v3 pool and then we are performing the swap you can see you can easily able to monitor the amount they have transferred you have got an idea that how it will help you so you can easily able to understand the contract interaction so there is a multiple contract and all of the contract are dependent on one another to make a particular transaction and that's what you can examine here so if you are building and working on a project where you can need the help of like a Unisoft router or maybe Unisoft v3 or v2 so you can easily able to integrate in your contract and you can predict the amount of gas fee you will pay so that's all data you will find here so again this tool is absolutely amazing i want you to come at least have a look try to do the testing try to analyze the gas price the, and the amount of transaction it's happening it will help you amazingly so there is a tons of thing you can able to find the block number the positions and you can is able to do tons of things you can go to the ether scan for checking this transaction you can go to this trending this one is also a very popular tool again i'm going to make a video on this that how you can verify your transaction on this particular tool it gives amazing data if you want to go into deep to see the contract interaction this one is the tool which i will make a tutorial on this we have this block c and we have this eth transaction so you can see it's a view multi transaction in one card. So it's a multi contract. So this will give you an amazing idea. Again, I don't want to ex extend this video, but I want you to come and have a look. Try to find the contracts. Simply come back here, go to this. And here you will find a bunch of contracts which is happening under the Uniswap or you can take any transaction. If you take a normal transaction, you can easily able to find the data related to that as well. So you can see we have bunch of transaction is happening, the amount. You can simply pick whatever you want. So let's go with this particular transaction, get the 
hash of the transaction come back here and paste and simply hit enter this will again give you the data about this transaction that how it's taking place so this transaction is token flow and you can see this one is a better one so we have this units of v3 pool and then we are interacting with the account so the one is calling the function then we are taking this width and then we are calling this builder you can see the amount of fund is getting involved in the transaction the burner all the things you can able to find so this one is the uni and this one is the away so tons of things is happening so again this one is amazing tool i want you to come and have a look if you really want to be a DeFi developer and you want to work on a DeFi product decentralized finance then this tool you're going to use very frequently for checking your transaction for building a contract and testing that how it's going to behave how you going to interact so my advice is to come and have a look try to get your symbol familiar and try to understand all of this data that what this data is about because you have to build the protocol and you have to design this data model so this data is going to be very helpful for you so that's the only thing from my end if you really want to have a deeper video on this about this particular tool then do let me know in the comment section so this one is the first tool which i use i will add four to five more videos like this where i will show you the tools which i use so i believe that you guys are enjoying this particular project betamask clone i want you to build this because this will teach you everything about the extension development so you can build your own crypto wallet so you don't need to depend on the metamask or any other wallet so try to build this particular project come back to the playlist we have tons of projects so we have nft marketplace we have the nft marketplace we have the units of clone we have the real estate dap tons of project we have come and try to build this will give you more idea the more project you will build the better idea we will have about the smart contract development and about the protocol design and how the transaction take place on the blockchain so that's the only thing from my end in this video hope you guys have got a complete picture and how you can utilize this particular tool so come and at least have a look so with that i'm ending this video and if you still have any question in doubt do let me know in the comment section i'll try to make a video on that have a wonderful day bye bye